on the third fret for this one. And then what this song does at the beginning is vamps or kind of changes around a C chord. The chords are C, that's third fret on A, second fret on D, and first fret on B. C, C major seven where you lift up the index finger and leave the rest of the chord intact. C7 where you put the index finger back and put your pinky finger filling in the gap of the C on the third fret on the G. And then it goes back to C7, so lift up the pinky, lift up the index. So C, C major seven, C7, C major seven. So get used to those chords. You don't ever need to lift up your middle and ring finger throughout all of those chords. Once you've got that, it's just a case of understanding the rhythm. Now the rhythm for this one, it's a little, little challenging in places, I won't lie, so I'm gonna take it slowly. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down. Now the reason why I've stopped there is because that's where the chord change happens. So I'm gonna do it slowly for you. The chord change is C to C major seven, so not a difficult change, just lift up the index. So watch when my index finger lifts up with the strumming pattern. Down, 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 miss, miss, up. lift up, we change chord on the up. So you lift up on the up. That's probably a good way of thinking about it. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, down. So you can see it's always the same rhythm, but you're always changing on that up strum. repeats when the singing starts. Yeah, so obviously it's very slow because of we're learning it, but you can hear the vocal fits there. So a little bit faster. And to make it really authentic like the song, when you change chord, do a louder strum on your up. So that really is the most sort of famous part in the song. Let's push on and learn the rest of it. So we do that chord progression, C, C major seven, C seven, C major seven twice. And then when we come to do it the third time, we're singing the line of, um, side the green, green grass, swing, swing, then swing the spinning stuff. meant to be an F. <laughs> you could do the full bar. I was deciding whether to teach the mini bar or full bar. Full bar is going to sound better for this, obviously. So instead of C, C major 7, C7, C major 7, the third time is C, C major 7, C7, F. Okay, so slowly. that that's placed in and that's a good sort of indication that we're about to go into the chorus. So the chorus is D minor, G, C, A minor. Let's do that first with the rhythm. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, down, down. So slowly the chord changes are still happening on ups. Down, 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 D minor, G, C, C7. So it's kind of like the same order of chords, but not A minor at the end, C7. So D minor, G, C, A minor is the first one. Second one is D minor, G, C, C7.
Okay, so from there onwards, it's still D minor G C for the lift up your open hand. C. G over B, which is just, in this case, it's middle finger on the second fret on the A string and index finger staying on the first fret on the B. A minor. Then G. Okay. And then finally, F. Then G, which we strum three times. I'm using this kind of G. I'm not using the folk G, ring and pinky on the third fret on the B and E string, middle finger on the third fret on the thickest string, doing three strums. So I'll take you through what's happening there with a little bit of vocal just to help you out from the beginning of the chorus. I'll do it slowly. Kiss me. To your intro okay so that gives you a rough idea of what is happening there obviously I'm not showing you how to play each of these chords I think they're, they're pretty standard chords that you guys should know um, after that you do another verse which is exactly the same as what we've already done uh, and then once you finish the chorus the second time so kiss me. there's some picked guitar you're just picking C C major 7, C7, seven, uh, and it's... And then this G7 is... And then you're into your um, in solo guitar where you're doing the chorus chords. Then you'll do a chorus again, which is the same order of chords. And when you're finishing on this, you finish with a fade out of the intro. 